Lizelle Brant here after practice with someone who I interviewed actually a few years ago when he was still back at Agora Hills yeah. High School. This is Trojan offensive lineman Kevin Groth. So Kevin, thanks for being here with me today. Absolutely, no problem. Congratulations on that very impressive victory against Stanford. I want to talk about what your thoughts are on the Stanford's defensive front seven, which I heard was a pretty aggressive defense. Yeah, they're a very good defensive line and a very good front seven. Um, they're a very aggressive team and they played very well and I give it and I just, they're a very good defensive line. Now the offensive line has um, actually been, I guess, been talked about in terms of well, sometimes it's um, questions whether or not it's been effective but it looks like it's been steadily improving across um, throughout the season. What are your thoughts on how you've improved? Um, I think we're just really motivated by Coach O right now and Coach Summers and Coach Craig. They've been just doing such a good job really just working our technique and just motivating us to be out there and really play hard and play for our brothers. You held together really well, in particular for the passing game on fourth and second and a lot of the plays against the Cardinal. What did that victory against Stanford mean to you? How did it rank in terms of um, the many victories that you've had during your career at USC? Um, it's definitely up there. Um, someone asked me that after the game. And uh, it's definitely between uh, the Oregon game two years ago, uh, beating UCLA 50 to nothing. And they're all, all three of those are pretty much up there tied right now. Great. Let's talk about the next game you mentioned, UCLA. It's not the next game, but how do you not overlook Colorado if you've got UCLA coming up after that? Uh, Colorado's a good team. Um, a lot of people um, kind of look past them, but they're, they're still a very good team, um, even though their record doesn't show it. Um, all these guys really play hard. Uh, defensive line's very good. Um, linebacking core is very good. So uh, we're still going to have a challenge on our hands. It doesn't mean that we could look past them. All right, you mentioned Coach o a little bit earlier. What has it meant to you for him to become the interim head coach, and how has that affected your play? It means a lot. Um, I've known Coach O since I was four years old, so I have a great relationship with him. And he's just been so great with us. It's like having a, another dad out there, and he treats us like he's... Uh, treats us like we're his kids and so it, it means a lot to us and he just motivates us and just wants us to have fun out there and that's what we've really been doing is having fun. All right lastly I understand you are at least right now the foreseeable end to a long line of traditions of graphs that have been here at USC starting with your father and then your brother. Um, what has it meant for you to be a part of that rich tradition? It means a lot. The school means a lot to me. Uh, I've been around here my whole life, and uh, it's really sad that it's finally coming to an end. Okay, thanks for your time, Kevin. No problem. Um, for more videos like that, please subscribe to the WeRSC channel. And again, for all things Trojan football, visit www.wersc.com. For Kevin Graff, I'm Lizelle Brandt. You're watching WeRSC.